Hi, this is Wayne Mansfield. Today is the day after Australia Day, a great celebration in Perth. Our one national event is called the Skyworks, where close to 300,000 people gather around the, uh, the Swan Water, or Perth Water, uh, on the Swan River and watch the fireworks. Uh, it was a great day. I spent time with friends at their house, which overlooks the city, and we enjoyed it. One of the great problems, though, of Skyworks is the anti-social behaviour, the mixing of alcohol, sun, uh, too much uh, uh, good times, and the police are always stretch of these things. But the, the reports are that it went better than normal. Uh, but Australia, though, was fantastic. Uh, we celebrate what a great country we live in. This year we looked at all the floods in Queensland, New South Wales, Victoria and Western Australia and fires and all the normal things that bring us as a country together. So uh, if you want to know more about Australia Day, have a look at my, at my blog and I've got some great stories there. The other thing I wanted to talk to you about is what do you do when somebody says uh, not so pleasant things about you on Twitter or Facebook uh, the worst thing to do is not engage those people. The best thing is to uh, acknowledge them and talk in positive terms. Remember, you can't build yourself up by bringing other people down. Uh, there's a great example where uh, over the last couple of days some people have seen fit to have a shot at me on uh, my Twitter account and so I've engaged them. Uh, you will see that engaging them runs some risk. One of the, the feedback uh, is it's quite nasty, but that's life, isn't it? People who have got nothing better to do want to bring down people who are, are doing great things. Uh, the last thing that I wanted to share with you today is something that I found via Robert Schobel, uh, who I follow on Twitter and Facebook, and this, this great application web-based, which means you can use it on your computer, not on an iPhone or an iPad or your smartphone, which allows you to look at Facebook with all the things that are happening. It reminds me a lot of what Facebook used to be uh, two or three years ago when you could see uh, and Facebook didn't make the choice of what they wanted to show you. It's called postpost.com uh, and it's brand new and it works fantastically well. Have a look at it and, and let me know what you think. So that's it for today. Uh, look forward to talking to you again soon.